Hello and welcome to the session on Amazon Kendra. This video is part of the AWS certified AIML bootcamp series. On behalf of the Cloud Expert Solution team, I would like to thank you for joining us and exploring this video. Before diving deep into Amazon Kendra and its capabilities, let's take a moment to review how traditional search works. Imagine we have a document repository containing various file types such as plain text, PDF, MS Word document, RTFs, Excel files, and others. When users search through these documents using a traditional search engine, the engine relies on specific methodologies such as full text search. In full text search, it scans the entire content of documents for keywords or phrases. Like if I would like to search cloud expert solution, it will look for that phrase cloud expert solution in all the documents. Then using metadata. In metadata, search is based on structured information like titles, authors, tags, or dates. And here is an example. If I want to search using metadata, maybe it will look for the documents authored by cloud expert solution team. Then using keyword search, in keyword search, it finds exact matches for specific terms, often without understanding the context. Here is an example. Maybe I am trying to look for certification word and wherever the certification arrives, it will provide me the details. And last but not least, pattern matching. Under pattern matching, it locates document using patterns or regular expression, such as identifying email address or phone numbers. And the document search result sometimes look like this. The search result typically includes the document paths, reference, or location. However, traditional search engine have a significant limitation. They cannot answer specific questions. Let me explain with an example. Suppose I am searching for COVID-19 test centers. A traditional search engine will return documents containing the word or phrases COVID-19 test centers, but it won't extract or directly provide the locations of the test center even though the answer exists within the document. Now let's compare the capabilities of a traditional search engine with Amazon Kendra. Yeah, this image resolution is not good. However, I would like to show the comparison in Elasticsearch, which is a traditional search engine. If you are trying to search the COVID-19 test center, then you can see the left hand side, we have all those orange highlights where it found a fragment of the phrases, maybe COVID-19, taste, center, that kind of fragmented word. However, when you search with Amazon Kendra, it is trying to provide me the answer or the location of the test center. Amazon Kendra is a fully managed service provided by AWS that uses machine learning to deliver highly accurate results. It helps organizations find the information they needed quickly and efficiently, even if when it's scattered across multiple locations and content repositories. Amazon Kendra uses machine learning to understand natural language queries and deliver more relevant answers from unstructured data. Amazon Kendra can match questions to the most relevant answers from a curated FAQ list making it ideal for customer support. Amazon Kendra can index a wide range of document types, including PDFs, Word documents, HTML pages, and making it easy to search through diverse content. You can also fine tune search results based on content attributes, freshness, and users' behaviors to improve the accuracy of the search result. Now let's check out what makes Kendra a powerful search? The step one is create index. Amazon Kendra uses data sources like Amazon S3 buckets, Amazon RDS, or even external sources like Google Drive, Salesforce, or Slack, or other custom data sources as a connector. And you can connect multiple connectors in parallel. Create an index from all the data sources and it will be an updatable index. Amazon Kendra supports documents of varieties of types like structured text 
an unstructured text file like PPT, MS Word, plain text, PDF, CSV, MS Excel, XML, JSON and others. Once it creates an index from the data sources, next step is to add documents directly to it or from a data sources. The last step will be to use Kendra API to use for search across data. And here are our users who can use Amazon Kendra API to search diverse file formats stored in different data sources. In terms of Kendra use cases, it can be used for enterprise search engine and it enhances employee productivity by providing accurate answer to internal queries. It can also work for customer support and it can improve customer service by quickly finding relevant answers to customer queries. We can also use Amazon Kendra for knowledge management, where we can organize and retrieve information from large knowledge bases. We can also use Amazon Kendra for research and development. It can accelerate research by finding relevant documents and data quickly. Here are some real life examples. 3M uses Amazon Kendra to improve search capabilities across its vast repository of technical documents, enhancing employees' productivity. On the other hand, PwC utilizes Amazon Kendra to provide accurate and timely information to its consultants to improve customer service. Now in terms of exam tips, if you find any questions with document search service, intelligent document search service, then think of Amazon Kendra. It could be the potential answer for you. I know by this time you may have some confusion between Amazon Kendra and Amazon Elasticsearch. Let me clarify that for you. So you should know what are the use cases where you should select Amazon Kendra versus what are the use cases you should opt for Elasticsearch. To start with use cases, Amazon Kendra can be used for enterprise search engine, customer support, knowledge management, NLP search, and research and development. On the other hand, for Amazon Elasticsearch, it is mainly used for log and event data analysis, full text search, or real-time application monitoring purpose. Amazon Kendra best suited for natural language queries, FAQ matching, intelligent search, whereas Amazon Elasticsearch best suited for large-scale data indexing, real-time search and analytics. In terms of main feature, Amazon Kendra has machine learning based search engine. It provides NLP or natural language processing, relevance tuning, whereas for Amazon Elasticsearch, it is a distributed search and analytics engine. If you want Kibana integration, then Amazon Elasticsearch, or if you want real-time data processing, then Amazon Elasticsearch is the answer for you. In terms of differentiator, Amazon Kendra focuses on intelligent search and natural language processing, whereas Amazon Elasticsearch is optimized for large-scale data indexing and real-time analytics. In terms of Amazon Kendra demo, it will be a very quick demo. Let's review the pricing first. Kendra offers two options, enterprise for production workloads and developer for development workloads. There are no upfront cost and you are charged on per hour basis. Now, as we discussed, the step one is to create index. Step two is to add the data sources. Once you created the index, you can upload the documents or you can upload the documents in S3 bucket and you can connect S3 with Amazon Kendra. And step three is test and deploy. You can also refer the Kendra API references, FAQs and developer guides. And here is the section. But for this demo, we'll start with creating an index. In this demo, our aim will be to review different configurations and parameters to create an Amazon Kendra knowledge index. Let's click on the create an index button. The first parameter is index name. I'll provide Cloud Expert Solution Demo Index or CES Index. I'll copy the same text for the description. For IAM role, I'm going to create a new IAM role role name i'll just provide the ces demo index and it is going to provide amazon kendra and the region i don't want any encryption tagging is optional i'll go to next in this screen we need to configure the capacity of the index for production workloads 
select enterprise edition for test and development workloads choose developer edition if you need gen ai capabilities and have a requirement to implement retrieval augmented generation or rag then select gen ai edition for this demo we will select gen ai edition and click next for access control i'll stick with the default options for token and for user group expansion i'll select none then click next now we are at the summary screen which provides an overview of all the selected parameters the final step is to click create to initiate the index creation once the index is created you can either directly upload documents into the index or attach an amazon s3 bucket where your documents are stored from there you can begin performing searches that's everything you need to know about amazon kendra for this certification thank you that wraps up this module if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up subscribe for more update and feel free to drop any question or feedback in the comments we would love to hear from you i hope this session helped you gain a deeper understanding and brought you one step closer to your learning goals thank you very much for watching and learning with us at cloud expert solution see you in the next module